I'm here at Mobile World Congress Barcelona and joining us today is Summer Chen, who is Vice President of CTE. So thank you very much for joining us. Thank you. Yesterday in your presentation in Manufacturing DX, you mentioned that the fully connectivity of digital infrastructure and the intelligent platforms are the twin engines for smart factories to accelerate the uh, intelligent manufacturing upgrade. Could you please explain us why this is so important? Uh, I think the intelligent manufacturing is a kind of trend for the digital technologies or cutting-edge innovations to help enterprises and uh, industries to get their uh, high e capabilities to facing the digital era. So that's why we call it it's a benefit or it's a value, it's a foundation for the enterprises to build this kind of a capability. We're choosing the 5G, we're choosing the cut edge, we're choosing the internal intelligence to making all these kinds of innovations to integrate it, to set up a kind of hardware and software capability to ensure them get the flexible and uh, um, how to say is a kind of um, a talent yeah. to facing the uh, new coming future requirements. That's why we are more focused on this kind of innovations. It's not just an application, it's a kind of ability or it's a set of a, um, a kind of new business chance for, for the customers, not just for the operators. So we are um, making keep, keep on going in this kind of innovation, not just provide the uh, industry gateway and all kinds of industry connectivity devices and a soft uh, application platforms or AI powered devices, AI powered equipment. And we are making deep research on the production process to making this high volume production efficient improvement to get the people they are in working in this environment, environment more clean and more efficiency in a clean, in a comfortable working environment. It's needed to set up this kind of a data platform to making the exact access and dealing with so it can help us to to um to to uh, making this kind of improvement for the owner of the factory to help get the more uh, good condition for the workers for the employees. So, uh, summer uh, uh, as I know, uh, said is quite experienced in building digital infrastructure and intelligent platforms. So, can you share with us? Uh, how CD is helping its customers and partners to achieve transformation in these two aspects and can you also let us know which are the main challenges associated with this process? Yeah, because there, there are lots of challenges yeah. exactly in the uh, enterprise, in smart factories. Some are logistical issue, some are processing um, efficiency issue, some are data connection, and sensor and the dealing with issue. So all kinds of uh, requirements is quite de di delivers or uh, diverse. So we need to make a uh, case by case and get exactly new their requirements. So it's not just a technical issue, it's a kind of scenario research. So we do this kind of connection innovation with our customers. So this is the first thing we want to do to find the exact the scenarios and exactly the requirement or making this kind of requirement to be the, the first priority we want to serve. And the second thing, as I mentioned in the purest speech, first we need to making the infrastructure upgrade. We're making the connection seamlessly. Not just the connectivity, it's also need the computing. We need uh, low legacy data processing capabilities. So we're using edge computing. We added AI capabilities beyond the connectivity and the computing power. So it's another thing we are always 
keep on doing to provide the computing and connectivity. At the same time, using 5G, using big data, and using an AI to all make these all integrations more efficient and more clever. And that's the second thing. The third thing is always um, collaboration with all kinds of partners. Yeah, we, we know ICT technicals, but enterprise, they knew how to process, how to product. They knew, their, they knew more about their business. So it's need a closely collaboration to make a coin closely conjoint to make these kinds of applications. Summer, with the improvements in productivity and also with the generation of new technologies, how do you think that future smart factories will look like? I think uh, smart factory is means highly efficient production and another is uh, intelligent management. So first we set up or, or build or uh, upgrade our infrastructure with the connectivity and the computing solutions making the coverless and the power for connections and computing power ability to set up. The second thing is making the data using because the data is a quite a valuable resources for the computer, uh, for the factory. So we need to make this kind of connected data to be accessing, to be processing and to be analyzed, to be more dealing with, uh, with our AI method. We are training, we are inferencing, and making all this process is up in a high efficient way to guarantee we have this kind of ability facing the digital areas requirement. That's why we are still strongly to do with our partners. Okay, Samir, thank you very much for your time. Thank you.